Are you sick of this? Yeah, me too. I'll show you how to 3D print and put this phone mount together. It fits any phone. The weight of your phone pulls the arms in from the sides using a gear mechanism. When you pick up your phone, it will release it. I printed all of the parts at a 0.2mm layer height with three walls at 10% infill. You can download the STL files to print this in the description. Start by screwing a 10mm M3 screw into the base as shown. Turn the base around and push the gear over this screw. Twist it around a bit and make sure it can turn freely. Put the lower rack mechanism into the base. It can't be slid in from the bottom, it must be inserted from above. Just the way I like it. Take the left and right arms and put them on the base, making sure to align them with the gear. When the gear is fully raised, the arms should be as far out as they can go. For easy assembly, once you do that, you can slide the arms in and let the base lower a bit. That will stop them from all falling out. Take the top and push it into the base. Once you've done this, slide the bottom rack up and down and see if it, the arms will move smoothly. If it doesn't work properly, you might need to redo it now. Anyway, um, nut on the screw we inserted earlier and turn the screw so that the nut is captured. Do not tighten too much. Just turn until the screw is flush with the nut. Screw in four 6mm M3 screws as shown. Make sure the mechanisms can still move freely. If not, try loosening the screws, either these four or the one in the base. Take a 10mm M3 screw and thread it through an M3 nut. Using this assembly, screw one of the longer conical posts into the lower rack as shown. Make sure to screw this into the left as shown. The screw will not go in all the way. Go as far as you can. After that, tighten down the nut to secure everything. Screw in the other longer conical post on the right side using a 6mm M3 screw. Turn around the assembly and screw in the vent clip as shown using two 6mm M3 screws. There is a notch in the vent mount for the back of this screw head to fit in, you can see that. Using two 10mm M3 screws, secure the other two conical posts onto the left and right arms, aligning the protrusion with the center of the phone mount. Place a rubber band between the two screws as shown. If your rubber band's too short, try using the lower screw hole for the screw that went on the base. That's all. Clip it into your car and give it a try. I love it. Now I have my hands free to do stuff like smashing that like button.